I'll see you in Disney World. Hello, today is January 28th, 2024. I just stopped and got me some Zaxby's to eat on the way. I still have around like six hours and 30 minutes left to go on my journey and I will update y'all on the way. This is the car situation right now. Everything is very packed. And Hello, so I'm at my second stop for gas and I still have about four hours to go. So this is gonna be really exciting. And I'm so ready to get there so that I can just go and lay in the hotel bed and just relax. I cannot wait to stop driving. Hi, I have made it to Florida and I just got my sun pass parking toll thingy thingy majiggy. And um, I can't wait. I'm only like two hours away from my apartment. <laughs> Hi, so I just got to the hotel and it is looking amazing and it's super clean and I love it. I've already set up my makeup and stuff for in the morning and then I'm about to take a shower and then I'm going to do my skincare and then I'll get ready for bed. Hello, so I pre-curled my hair so that all I had to do was touch it up in the morning and I'm about to brush my teeth and put my retainer back in and just get ready for bed. So it is currently 4.59 in the morning and I'm about to start doing my makeup and getting ready. Hi, so I'm going to start. I usually start with my eyebrows in the mornings just because it helps a lot to get them already done. That way I don't smush them or anything. And um, I was going to put contacts in, but I left these in here for too long and they're dried up. So, pro tip, if you have contacts, don't let them dry up in your, um, in your cases. So, these are the mascaras that I use, and, um, this is my lash primer, um, and then this is just my mascara. I also have this, which is the CoverGirl Lash Blast Volume, and it's waterproof. So if it rains today, I think it'll be perfect. I didn't mean to buy a waterproof, but this works. It's fine. So I'm going to start with my brows, and this is the e.l.f. Wow Brow. And I've had this for a little bit. Um, I just really just brush my brows up whenever I do it, and then just put them back down. It's not that big of a deal. And if I um, get them too dark, I'll just make sure that both of them match. And if I get it on my eyebrow, underneath my eyebrow, like I did right there, I will just clean it off. It's not that bad. I am going to breakfast at 6 o'clock. I am making a mess on my eyebrows. I'm going to breakfast at 6 o'clock. Um, that way I can eat before I get my day started. So I'm really excited about that. And I have some lashes that I'm gonna try, but also I'm wearing my glasses because I told you about my contacts. So we're gonna see how that all works. We're just gonna see if it'll work. All right, so I go in with a little bit of color correction on some of my dark spots and um, then I just take a damp beauty blender and I just blend it in. And then next, I'm going to put my foundation on. This isn't my exact shade, but we're going to make it work. Because once I get to Florida and once I move in and once I start working and stuff, I'm going to get a whole lot tanner. So I'm going to need something darker. But this is what we'll deal with today. Now I'm going in with some foundation. And... This isn't exactly my color, but we are definitely going to try and make this work. I used to just put it on my beauty blender and then blend it that way, but that doesn't seem as effective to me. So, always pat, don't smear. Um, 
and I'm just going to blend this out and it's going to look great. My foundation is blended and everything. I'm going to go in with this concealer. Now, this is a little darker than I wish it would be, but like I said earlier, we're going to make it work. So I put it under my eyes and on this pimple and then on like my T-zone kind of, and then I do this and this. So this is what it should look like. And we always want the lifted effect. So when we're doing our bronzer or when we're doing our concealer or anything like that, we really want to lift whenever we're applying it. So I'm going in with a little bit of powder. Hopefully I don't get it on my shirt, but if I do, it'll be okay. It's my fault for wearing it. But this foundation doesn't match my color exactly, so I'm gonna have to blend it down my neck to make sure that there's no line and to make sure that it's all even and there aren't any harsh lines or anything like that. So this is my contour and I found, I found this to be the hardest, almost, well, one of the hardest parts in my makeup routine is this contour because it's so hard to blend out and then I have to make sure it's on the right spot and then sometimes a wet beauty blender doesn't work that I need to brush. Always remember, pat, don't smear, um, especially when you're using brushes. This side is always so much better than the other side, but I'm also going to go in with a little bit of bronzer as well on top of this, so it shouldn't be too bad. Alright, so this is the makeup and the outfit, and I'll see you in Disney World! Hello, so I've made it to my apartment and I've started moving a few things in, but I am moving in by myself, so this is going to take a good minute. So, this is my cute little mirror to my closet and I have some clothes in there. This is my nightstand that I brought and then all of my stuff. And then this is all my roommate stuff. Her name is Rachel and she is super, super sweet. So this is my room so far, and I haven't made my bed yet. This is Rachel's side. I haven't made my bed yet, but I'm really excited to come back from my background check and redo my room and put everything together, and I'm excited to see it all put together. And that is a rug that's going to go right there. Also, I have to let you know that this is my... Um, bathroom side and then I have this super cool Madison cabinet if I can get it open super cool Madison cabinet and this huge mirror which I love also my roommate has these little things and she said that I could have some and it's so cute also my stepmom knitted me this and it is so beautiful look at my rug compared to hers it's okay it's okay you know you know it's okay because my rug is beautiful. Her rug is beautiful too, but it's huge. But anyway, I'm about to go to um, my background check and then me and Rachel both have another event at four. Hi everybody. So this is my room. Well, my side of the room all done and put together. All right, so over here I have these beautiful flowers that I made that were gifted to me by my boyfriend and then I have these two super cute pictures. I have my Stanley and my Mickey ears. I have some jewelry right here. These are all my shoes. This is where I'm going to keep my shoes. And then I have these two super cute. The lighting in here isn't perfect, but we'll make it work. We're going to do our makeup in the bathroom anyway. So this is my favorite backpack ever. It was gifted to me by my aunt Cindy and um it's just so cute it's a cinderella because you know cinderella cinderella super cute and then i have my nightstand and this is all my bedding this is the rug that my other aunt gave me her name is aunt beck and it's so soft and it's so pretty and i love it
lead us on a journey to discover who we are meant to be. All we have to do is look inside our hearts and unlock the magic within. Ready to begin, let the wonder take hold, feel it draw you in. Hello. So we we're not even there right then. We are stuck on the Tomorrowland, not the speedway. People mover. We're stuck <laughs> on Tomorrowland people mover. Hello, so Rachel and I are at Publix and we are grocery shopping and getting stuff for our apartment. Body. So I am vlogging on my phone because my camera is messing up. This is my vlog camera, but it's messing up really bad. So I'm vlogging on my phone, but we're gonna make it work and y'all are gonna get the content that y'all need. But we just got back from grocery shopping. This is the outfit for today. We have my super cute flower pants and my Brooks, my work shoes, so I can break them in. And then this is a sweatshirt from Lululemon that I got in Seattle. This is also a shirt from Lululemon that I got in Seattle. I just did a cute little braid in my hair. And it's so cool because I made it look like it was going all the way down, but for real, I actually just braided this and put it in the ponytail and then braided this part. But it's super cute and we're about to go to the parks and have another day of fun. We just walked in and I got a super cute video which should be behind this one of me scanning my watch and using my fingerprint and we are just about to walk around the world and maybe like eat some beignets or something. I think that they're here and it's gonna be so much fun. I have this super cute, super cute hairstyle. Hello. So we are in this ride and we're about to get on and it is so cool. Hello. So we just got off of Test Track and Rachel was scared that her earrings were going to fall off. I so took she them took them ride. out. But it was very fun and I don't know where I'm going, but we're going to Hello. eat. So we just got done eating and we we're about to get on the monorail and just go back to our apartment. Hi. So this is the end of the video and see you real soon, y'all.